<laughs> All right, welcome to the Science Channel. Today we have something super interesting, amazing, fantastic, cool, whatever you want to call it. Thanks to this guy, our homie Mark Serbu from Serbu Firearms. He made these 50 BMG micros with 10 inch barrel. Jasper, give me a close up on this one. Probably one of the first times anyone has ever done this before. This is based on the RN50 concept. It's got the same receiver, the brake action trigger on the bottom, but instead it has a 10 inch barrel. It uh, kicks like a horse. <laughs> <laughs> we also put some uh, $30 Amazon red dot sign on them. We thought it was going to be pretty cool. I like this. Uh, yeah, and anyways, for people that don't know what an RN50 is, it's a single action 50 BMG rifle that uh, obviously Mark Serbu sells. And uh, opens the breech like that. You put your round in there and close it, bam. We'll show you in a second how that works. But anyway, there it is. He managed to make this as short as possible and you can hold it with one hand and shoot it. And not only did he make one, but he made two of them right there, side by side. So you can have two and uh, one per hand. I think that's very uh, efficient and effective. Anything else you want to add to that, Mark? I didn't say anything yet, so how can I add? Oh, <laughs> well, <laughs> add something to what I said. <laughs> It requires a lot of uh, documentation and papers, filling out paperwork to have something like this. It's not something you can just do regular background check on and get one. There's a lot of rules and regulations. Yeah. NFA short barrel rifle. NFA short barrel rifle, SBR. Okay, I think we did enough talking. Do we have a ballistic dummy lab right down there. Uh, let's actually get closer, Jasper. Ballistic dummy lab send us this guy. It's got all the synthetic uh, internals as a human would have. It's got the bones, the organs, lungs, liver. What else just fits in there? Heart. Heart. Yeah, I forgot about the heart. That's important to have. And gel, gelatin. It's super heavy. Takes about a couple of guys to pick that up. Well, Jasper can do it alone, but... Uh... <laughs> what is it with people always wanting to slap this? Is it the sound or what is it? I want to tell you guys about today's sponsor is grip6.com. They're the ones who helped us out and put all this together, pay for all the logistics, getting everyone over here. They sell belts, cool wallets, and socks. I will tell you more about them in a minute, but I just want to give it a quick shout out to them. We really appreciate them. They're always helping us out. It would mean a lot to me if you click the link, go check it out. We got both of these guys here. They're both uh, loaded. And uh, I think what I'm going to do first, I'm going to shoot the head, see what happens to that. Hopefully nothing flies out of his head and hits me in my face. I didn't think about that, but yeah, uh, should be fine. The bones and the... That's pretty ready? I'm ready. So this is one cool way to pull these back. Check this out. <laughs> okay, safety off on both of them. Okay, one, woo, two, three. Internal bleeding. <laughs> I was hoping it kind of does more of exploding, but it didn't. Did I hit them both of oh. the... Oh, oh God. Ah, poor guy. Did I miss one? No, it yeah. grazed the top. the top. And the, yeah, both. Oh, so maybe I missed one. Only one of them hit. It's not bad. This is also another one, Mark mate. It's got the 18-inch uh, barrel instead of the 10-inch. Same concept. So we got the 10-inch, 18-inch, and the 26-inch. Oh, poor guy is bleeding over here. Pobre. All right. Okay, that's ready. Ready? I'm ready. Fire in the hole. Fire in the hole. It's going right in and out. <laughs> Poor guy, look at the other side. Oh man, his jaw is broken. You know what I should do? Shoot it with like a 44 Magnum Desert Eagle Auto. See what happens to his head. Listo? I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay, three, two, one, fire in the hole. So 
that's the kind of results I was looking for. <laughs> oh, that worked pretty good. Well, we got the body. Let's shoot the body. Okay, that's pretty ready. I'm ready. Let me cock these. These are actually both cocked. Oi, oi. Okay. And the only safe way actually to do this is to slam them back like this. Okay. That's pretty ready. I'm ready. Ready? Fire in the hole. One, two, three. Yeah, one, one two. On top. At the back, you get a bigger hole on the back side, but it's not exploding like how I thought it would explode. <laughs> you can see the bone. This is amazing how they put all the stuff together. Good job, Ballistic Dummy Lab. Check them out. There'll be a link in the description for them also. So I have a different, uh, since this guy doesn't want to blow up, I have a different kind of tool for that. Richard made this for us. It's a seven round shotgun. You can put seven shots in here. <laughs> that thing just fell in the background. And uh, shoots them all at the same time. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put two dragon's breath, we're gonna put three double out buck, and we're gonna put two slugs in there. A little bit of everything, just no bird shot. And we should see some fire and some uh, destruction. So they all slide right in there, like that. And this is the whole mechanism. We're gonna call this the receiver and it's got the firing pin in there yeah. and the pins all hit at the same time. You see that, how cool is that? And we have a safety that goes in there, right there. <laughs> High tech. A block of metal. Okay, we're gonna set this up and get ready and show you guys what happens if you get shot with this guy. We are ready. We put the tripod right over here. That's an M2 tripod and we have our uh, shotgun on it. This is a good time to thank grip6.com for uh, helping us out always. They never say no to anything I ask for. They always say, sure, we trust you, do the right thing. Check them out, link in the description. Okay, let's go. One. Dragon's breath was pretty cool. It was a big chunk of the, the dummy that flew towards me. <laughs> the blood splashed right into the camera. Oh, jeez. That fire thing was a cool idea. That was a good idea. Jesus. The blood splashes on the screen. <laughs> what a perfect touch. <laughs> wow, that was crazy. That's funny. Check this out. Oh, ew. <laughs> Gross. Oh my god. Disgusting. <laughs> the whole rib cage opened up. Wow. Okay, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It takes a lot of work for all of us to get over here and uh, make these videos happen for you guys. So it will mean a lot to me if you guys actually go check out grip6.com, link in the description. Also, thank you to Ballistic Dummy Lab, Serbu Firearms, Mark Serbu, Richard, and Jasperida for recording. And uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you. We'll see you guys next time. So oh, I'd like to thank grip6.com again for sponsoring the video. They make these cool, stylish, 
belts and buckles that are super easy to use and they look very stylish. That's pretty, give me a zoom in on them. I'm gonna show you guys how they look and how they operate real quick. Very seamless when it tucks in right on the bottom, but they sell the buckles, all sort of designs and styles and colors, and they also have the belts to go with them. You can just have one belt and multiple buckles if you want to, and the way you change them out is super easy. You just kind of pull your belt out. This kind of goes on the bottom like that. You pull your belt out and you can swap it out. Let's say this is not for today. You can pick a different one that it's like that. You stick it right on the bottom like that, pull it out. And in less than 60 seconds, you have yourself a what, Jasperi? A new a belt. New design, new belt. And this goes right on the top and you pull it from the bottom. And there you have it, in less than 60 seconds, I think it was 60 seconds, yeah, it had to be, maybe 15 seconds. You have yourself a new design, and if you don't want this brown one, you can sw swap it out for a black one. And that's how simple it is. They have it available in multiple colors. They also sell wallets and socks, a bunch of different designs, colors, and styles to choose from. Grip6 has been a great sponsor of this channel. We really appreciate them. They've been sponsoring us for many years and I've been using all their products for a lot of years and I have nothing but good stuff to say about them. So it would mean a lot to me and us if you guys go click the link in the description to show some love and support to them too.